And it's Nigeria's Independence Day anniversary, and President Mamadou Buhari has kicked off activities uh, this morning with a traditional national broadcast. In his speech this morning, the president boasted that Nigeria is taking the fight against terrorism and other crimes to the enemy. Part of the strategies deployed are the purchase of equipment to be used to curb crime in the Gulf of Guinea, the recruitment of 17,000 military personnel, and the planned recruitment of 10,000 police officers annually over the next six years. We are taking the fight to our enemies from all angles, and we are winning. Earlier this year, I launched the Integrity National Security and Water Waste Protection Infrastructure, the Deep Blue Project, which is designed to secure Nigerian waters up to the Gulf of Guinea. I am happy to inform Nigerians that we have taken delivery of key assets for this project and very soon its impact will be felt. In the Northeast region alone, over 8,000 Boko Haram terrorists have surrendered. To support our surge approach to fighting banditry, the Nigerian armed forces have recruited over 17,000 personnel across all ranks. Furthermore, I have also approved for the Nigerian police force to recruit 10,000 police officers annually over the next six years. The president also disclosed that 5 million Nigerians have been vaccinated against COVID-19. This is as the government is exploring every possible avenue to get more vaccines into the country. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.